sure the animal will wipe him out there. Hello there. Um, sorry, I was um, just looking at some various bits and pieces. Um, first off, uh, good morning. It's not good morning at the moment. Apparently, it's going to rain later, so they tell me. Um, now, uh, I've decided I'm going to do some bits and pieces um, today, mostly to do with. Um, Overseers and old, old missions. I know one of those involves launching a new I've never done that yet. So that's a bit of a bit of a, yeah. Um, now I've just found the Overseer's log for Mountainside, which is basically. Um, the Overseer feeling very sorry for herself. We're in the Mountainside. Um, Outside bed and breakfast thing at the moment. Today is going to be a little bit bitty because I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing. Try and do the overseer thing, but I don't think I'm up to um, launching a nuke today. Uh, that's going to take some research. I know there's a lot to it, and I've looked it up before, but never actually done it. So, uh, yeah. We'll see what happens when the time comes for that. I've got a bed and breakfast here. Where the hell did I get that from? Yeah, over income. Right. It doesn't sound in a good way, does it? Ooh, the bomb head. Right, so next thing to do then I think will be to um, you know, do some scrapage. Let's see the looking chair. Yeah, so I'll get out of here first of all. Now, I'm, I've got quite a few of these um, overseer's logs, uh, which I'll go to in a minute, so you know what's going on. Um, so, I've got pretty much all of them. I've got two mounts inside one. I wonder how I managed that one. I must have picked it up before then. Uh, Right, the only one I can't seem to think of that I've got is um, Al Allegheny, we've got the top of the world. Allegheny in Fort Defiance, McClintock, uh, Fort Defiance, and, no, not Fort Defiance, we've got that one, McClintock, got that one, Charleston, got that one. From looking at the phone, what I'm going, I'm sorry about it. Uh, Grafton, we've got on that one. We've got Site Alpha, so Bravo, and Site Charlie, all three of those. Overseer's log, this will kind of. Okay, you've got something to listen to. 
Nuke launch. So it looks like all we've got to do is a nuke launch. I can't really do that at the moment. Um, Overseer's not a nuke launch. Close to a previous three follow takes after a player character on the service. That doesn't necessarily mean me. There's a nuke to target that is not a Fisher site. So we've uh, close to the previous three follow takes. So we've got to wait till someone launches a nuke and then go either to site alpha it's like Bravo or site Charlie and find the other one. Uh, you know, nothing we can do until someone wants to use a nuke really. Okay, let's see what else we can do in the way of missions then. Have uh, we got any miscellaneous ones? Uh, that's items. Um, I'm going get rid of that for now. Uh, I'm going to the tab hole. I'm still working on that. Uh, I'm missions. Oh, organic solution, miscellaneous. Started so uh, got some cat oh, over in of course. Uh, which of course means where are we? Um, we are here directly south of the railway. That's food. It feels like coming home, um, getting into uh, Fallout 76 after playing on. Um, Yes, yeah, so Elder Scrolls Online. Okay, it feels like coming home. Which is good. Drinks. Uh, some royal jelly. Some salty steak and some blackberry. That'll do. Well fed now. I'm going to head to the railway station. Can't run because we're over encumbered. I was um, watching somebody playing this uh, game on another stream, uh, on a YouTube stream it happens, and uh, he was saying that he remembers seeing um, a an interview with uh, Todd from Bethesda many moons ago, and uh, when this uh, first came out, Todd was saying that um, this game would be 16 times the detail of previous Fallout games. Now, um, I'm well aware of the fact that uh, you can't quantify 16 times the detail. What's going on there? But it makes you wonder what, exactly what he's getting at. He's straight, dead straight away. Lovely. I wouldn't fight Charlie anyway. So. Uh, I'm not too worried about all the junk there, I can keep that. I'll get that in a minute if necessary. Uh, yeah, it's so like 16 times the detail. I mean, I played Fallout 4, and I remember thinking Fallout 4 was very flat in terms of graphics. Um, so I tend to think that is it, the improvements in the graphics are okay, but I wouldn't go as far as to say 16 times the detail. If you look at some of the new vegetation, they are certainly better. Sixteen times. 
vendor unit is equipped with anti-bad measures. Don't get any ideas, dump. Uh, right, so I'm going to do anything apart from scrap at the moment. Actually, come to think of it, we're not even um, over encumbered. I just remember I dropped all the junk, didn't I? No, we're not even bunker over encumbered, so. Um, well, better still, let's just get, get rid of everything we've got here. Something to come down to roll one. Uh, ah, it's probably what it is. Cool, oh, the house means I'm going to be using that one. Uh, yeah, of course, you haven't scrapped my guns, have we? No, that's right, I can bear with me a second. Let me scrap weapons. Some I've got. Uh, well, let's get rid of any ammo that we might get in excess of, I always do. Uh, we've got we plenty of them. Yeah, I've got loads of those. I've got the flares. Got fusion cores, gamma rounds we don't need, plasma cartridges, we've got a lot of shots with the shells we don't need. That should take us down to 273, that'll do. Right, um, so, what to do, what to do. Um, I think I might try and get the jump back, I don't really need to, but you know, could do it anyway. Got no mission showing at the moment, so we're pretty free to do whatever we want. That's one way, I suppose we're going that way. Yeah, so it's 16 times detail. I think it's, it's a bit of an unverifiable claim, to be honest. Uh, it's definitely good graphics. And this is not, not an ultra, this is on, um, I just believe it's, it's, what I believe is high graphics, not ultra. Uh, but even so, it's still pretty good. And of course, it's a, a newer, a lot newer game. 2018, I think, where it's Fallout 4 was a lot, a lot before, a lot before that. So, um, it's going to be better graphics anyway, but uh, it's a typical advertising guy, he's going to say that, isn't it? He's going to say everything is better, and he might well be right, who knows? Hello, Site Not, welcome back. Back to Fallout, as I said yesterday. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing today, just playing generally. Not sure whether I'll be doing a stream tomorrow, I think I might give it a miss tomorrow. Um, they do take it out of me, um, but, but not, not as young as I used to be. Sometimes I just like to sit and watch other people playing games. <laughs> Uh, I do. Oh. 
I do try to stream on Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, but um, as I say, being of the old persuasion, it doesn't always work. knew that was going to happen. I didn't even shoot anything. Okay, so let's go back to here. Um, <laughs> okay, so I'm going to see you back in a minute. Right, let's have a look at what's going on in here. Plenty of buildings here. Yeah. Stand there staring at me, you bed. Uh, where'd it go? Yeah. Jack, this, this does it every time. This, this gun is useless when it comes to reloading. It's a great gun for general purpose, but to get it to reload takes ages. Absolutely ages. Right, try again. Disappearing and fall off. Don't fall off, I need to get your stuff. Right. Now, looking here, they're usually in these type of buildings over here, the, uh, these ones, there tends to be a workbench, which I could have done with earlier when I went to the train station. But there you go. So we're going here. I've got a feeling there's going to be a lot of creatures in it, so I'm going to be very careful. I think I'll take some rad away. Uh, mm, 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 mm. Oh, I've got loads of rad away. Okay. Right. Overseer's cat, but all we've got is the stupid. Copper pot of steel, ceramic. And the paint cans gives us lead, I believe. Depends what's in there. What we could do with that, we can always do with that. Need that to repair the armour that I'm wearing. Right, so there's nothing in there, so we must have taken this. Shoot them, you're supposed to use them.
lot in there worth looking at. We're still looking for some sort of workbench. And also whatever I dropped before. Which would be over there. There somewhere. Okay, this way. Gangrenous ghoul. You ever had a gangrenous ghoul, Mrs? Welcome back. Yeah, um, I was uh, doing a Monty Python yesterday. I was watching some, uh, some Monty Python uh, last night on YouTube just for the fun of it. And um, it just occurred to me that there is no way on God's green earth that you'll be able to show that sort of stuff today. Some of it would be considered extremely racist, even though the ironic thing is that they were um, actually parodying racists. But uh, yeah, wouldn't be able to show it, definitely. There's a little bag over there, so I better go and grab that. So, um, oh, quite a lot in there. Yeah, Blazing Cellar was definitely not. <laughs> uh, one famous scene around a campfire comes to mind when they're all um, releasing wind, shall we say. And uh, another scene where it parried this racism. I won't go into details because we literally can't talk about that one here. No, not gonna, not in this, not in this era. Right, so that was one that we were looking at. That was site alpha um, from basically. Can't ask. Looking to go to. This overseer business a bit more fun over the last, last um, bit about that is I know someone's got a launch and nuke as I understand it. Uh, right, I'm going to drop these super thin packs, so I never use those. Uh, that'll be quite a bit of weight gone. And we're going to look at our other missions and see what else we've got. Their events, that's no good. Ladies. Interesting one, I don't know where that is. It's over here somewhere. It's somewhere we've never been as well. A couple of places we've never been. That's a fisher site. Lost town. So, let's see if that comes up on the map. If we, um, that's the one. If we select it. Uh, do the explosives, we cover the bombs. Right. Let's see if we can find out roughly where they are. It looks like the weather's taking a turn for the worse on me. Um, somebody dropped a nuke. Was it just a bad storm? Uh, that was a bad storm. I'm trying to find where I've got to go again. Oh dear, sorry about this. Final explosives. Soon, and that will take us to. Hmm. We'll try going there first of all. Talking about the wind is coming up here as well. I don't know whether you can hear any of that. There's a couple of doors banging quite a lot. <laughs> There has been a severe weather warning for this area for um, weather. 
for wind, sorry, weather. Uh, what have you blowing about? The trouble is, of course, in the summer you've got all the winds open because it's hot, supposedly, and it isn't, not at all. <laughs> Far from it. I've got a jumper on today and jogging trousers just to keep warm, basically. Uh, right, this is a daily quest, it's nothing spectacular. This is where I recover some bombs. So here we go, we'll recover the bombs. Dirty water. Dirty water. Come to think of it, I only, I only really watched Blazing Saddles once. It wasn't uh, a film that I could say I, I enjoyed on a comic level very much. It was very much um, a couple of jokes and the rest of it was just... Uh, I don't know, I just didn't enjoy it that much. Um, as I say, it was quite good um, for a certain jo couple of jokes, and that was it really. Um, what was that over there? There's some stuff over here. Oh, just part of the vegetation, I think. Right, so we're going to a dam. The only one we've already been to because it's always marked on here. I'm going to try and locate a bomb. Let's locate a bomb. Oh, they're all here. Now, that, um, the bomb thing, that was. Um, oh, God, what was his name? Inspector Cluzo. Saw several films of, um, featuring Inspector Cluzo. And they were quite funny. Um, Peter Sellers was. Uh, Another British uh, comedian. Um, let's go and see what I'm trying to do. Oh, yeah, I know. If I jump down there, I'm going to break everything I've got, so I'm going to put the power up on. And jump. Because it's quite a long walk down there. See roughly where we're supposed to be going, they're all marked, which is good news. Uh, now, if we go over here, we'll go across rather than jumping down there. I think I might just do a few dailies today because um, I'm not in the mood for doing a really, really long quest. It'll take too long. Alright. Cool. Disappearing. What are you going over there? start taking just one need now because um, if I take too much stuff I end up over come so quickly. Right, let's go and get this guy next. Companion, I'm assuming you mean do I play with anybody? No, I don't. Usually play uh, like a lone uh, thing. The trouble is, the sort of time that I'm on, a lot of people aren't. 
Um, so I tend to uh, probably just exploding it wasn't me. There's nothing in this game like that. Uh, you can get pets for your, your camp, and they will, um, I believe, after the. Uh, sorry, bear with me. They will. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't even know. The dog was. As far as I'm, I can see, the dog was indestructible. You couldn't kill it. Um, even, if you, even if it sort of um, was down, it would get back up again. Um, sorry, bear with me. So you can get um, a dog for your camp that acts as a collector. It collects junk while you're away from your camp and then puts it in your um, puts it in your stash. But no, apart from that, um, there is a companion at all camps. You can get allies. I've um, got a lady astronaut that I sort of uh, helped out and she's an ally in my camp mainly because she's quite an attractive young lady and that's the way I roll. Um, you can also get a guy who runs a, a, like a bar and he acts as kind of a trader at your camp. But there are no companions who go around with you like uh, like uh, Dogling I think it was called when he pulled out for. No, I haven't played for that shelter. That's a mobile game, if I remember rightly. Um, not really my sort of thing. I don't like mobile games. I find they tend to be a bit um, not not enough action for me. Uh, right, one over there. We have a jump. Ooh, oh, good. Well, I say I've never played it, so I really don't know what the game's about. But uh, I'm sure. I'm sure it's probably entertaining enough, but uh, not as a thing that I don't enjoy playing. Well, I've got some super mutants here, I'm getting out of there while I can. Because they're going to miss me completely if I go far enough. into uh, mobile games. I mean, I think for that show you could play on other other PCs and so on, but uh, again, not, not really my sort of thing. Right, so the other one looks like it's inside. Yeah, I, I see what you're saying. Let's have a read this. Cool, I'm trying to find 
depend on taking a running mission in the way for that to Yeah, um, I, did, I, th I think I remember trying to play it once, but it seemed to me like, like um, it was a, a third job, or second job or whatever, um, so I didn't really enjoy it. But um, whatever, you know, courses for courses, whatever you, you feel is best for you, you do you. Right, now let's find another daily to do. Over here. Oh, Port Defiance, okay. I'm going over Port Defiance again then. Over encumbered, of course I'm over encumbered. What else would I be? Right, okay. This is an area I haven't spent much time in actually, previously. I get the impression that the bombs uh, mutated everything. <laughs> Whatever it was I just hit, it didn't do me any good. It depends on what you find. It all depends on what you find relaxing, really. So my wife tends to enjoy uh, simple games. Oh, we're going up there, we're going to sort him out one or the other. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they were, lots of robots here, and they're not very good for being nice to people. Uh, right, so where shall we respawn? Uh, Simon's cat, I've never come across that one. I'll, uh, I'll see if the missus enjoys it. Uh, Right, where were we? Where were we? Oh, I've got to respawn somewhere. Um, we might as well make it a railway station. This is going to cost us caps, but better than nothing. Finding sleep hard to come by at the moment. Um, hmm, I'm usually wide awake with um, with the dawn. Like as soon as the sun rises, I'm up. Usually not good. But uh, also, um, sleeping is difficult to come by because of the. I don't know really what it is. It's not because it's summer, because it's not hot. It's, it's quite cold actually. What's this smoke over here? What that is? I'm not that keen to find out. Um, yeah, I, I just have trouble sleeping. And normally, if I have trouble sleeping, it doesn't matter because I can I can lay in in the mornings. Um, it doesn't get uh, doesn't get light till quite late on in the winter and I can sort of like go back to sleep and roll over and oh I know where this is. Um roll over, go back to sleep and that's it. But in the in the summer I wake up early in the morning and I can't go to sleep with the sun shining. And I can't go to sleep with the sun shining. Um right, we're near a station we might as well go and see what's in here. Nothing by the looks of it. Okay. Tinker's workbench, which is one thing that we need a lot of. Uh, 
Yeah, I think it's about. I mean, I, I don't know. There's a lot of stories why um, daylight savings time or um, turning the clock back, as we in this country was um, invented and, and usually to do with farming during the war, uh, World War Two. Um, so uh, yeah, I see what you're saying. The body tends to get used to one type of uh, time zone and end up reloading. Um, okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to make some ammo, if I can, which I should be able to. I really need the moment, it's 45, and I've got my gunpowder. Okay, what can I do? Can I do explosive ammo? Yes, it uses lead. I think I might do some, some of those. I'll get loads of those. And some plasma cells. Right. Next. Oh, I've made too much ammo. Right, okay, so we need the stash. Still over encumbered. Let's see what we can sell to this guy. Be well over encumbered, actually. Right, let's trade a load of stuff then. Um, I'm going to get those, that's going to be some weight. Fusion uh, core we need. Get rid of those. And those, and that, and those. Right. Weapons, nothing on the weapon front. Armour, nothing on the armour front. Food and drink. Nothing vast there. We could drop some of the canned dog food. Some of those as well, actually, come to think of it. That's it. Right, okay, we're under encumbered again now. Okay, um, 
Yeah, trouble sleeping is not my uh, not an enjoyable thing for me. I, I tend to feel very um, yeah, like I have today. Can't get the words out. I had a terrible night last night. Actually, I was trying to think of a word, and I won't go into why because it's not a nice word. But, but I, um, I was thinking about the World War Two and the Nazis, and they had a policy of creative. Um, Creative uh, selective breeding. I couldn't remember what it's called. I mean, a lot of people espouse this. I think Bill Gates is a fan of it as well, which uh, is another issue altogether. Uh, and it was eugenic, the word I was after, but I could not remember what it was called. It was a nightmare. Right, so, uh, very hard the enemy. Come on, go in there and we'll go to our. Data and daily part of the enemy, and it is here. Oh. Okay, let's join the event while we're at it. and quiet last. Right, let's see how much stuff we can get in. Quite a bit of stuff here. Um, um,
Jersey one, this one. Seems to be about it. Let's go and see what we can do about this mission, uh, whatever it is. one of the ones that brought it down. Okay, so let's go and find this uh, mission. I did say my name was Phil. Yeah, sorry, I was right in the middle of that for a while. Um, yeah, my name is Phil, definitely. And feel free to use it. Right. Start doing 
this one, so be to get to the automated research lab. Just doing this to get AR malfunctioning by any means necessary. It's the mainframe online. Upload ARP001, two men in the team, stable home secure the lab, viable school piece, DNA samples will be sent after. Blah blah blah. Infiltration and security is paramount. Tag the all the mailbox will contact the responders. Okay, that's that. Okay, let's find out for this. Um, I can't remember now where it's Once again, I'm going to try. Let me find out what this is. Then. Yeah. I'm going to try and drop some of the ammo. Find the automated research terminal. Okay. But first, we're going to have to go and find the workbench.
bit jerky today, I must say. The graphics are very jerky. Splat. Alright, I feel like a good splat every now and again. I keep picking stuff up, why do I do it? There's no point. Get to look down. Well, down to 277 ammo, that's bad news. Ah, we just. Oh, God. by one of them sooner or later and that was it. And we're still over encumbered. I don't know we can be over encumbered when we just died and dropped all our junk, if you'll pardon the expression. <laughs> right, so where do we find a set of power armour? Yeah, they are. And they shouldn't be able to kill you. Not that much. Um, right, one thing I am going to do actually is check and see whether the thing, see whether the power armor needs re, redoing. Um, it does look cool though, doesn't it? Uh, that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. Oh, that looks fair, yeah. Oh no, that bit, bit needs repairing. Uh, no repair kits. What are we missing? Uh, copper, of course, it's always copper. So, anyway, that's not too bad. Uh, so, there's only one bit that's really in serious state, and that's not too bad. So, we'll pull one on the back. Uh, and then, we do what we should have done in the first place. And scrap some items from the water need scrapping and why and where and whatever. Uh, favourite weapons we don't need nothing in there. Armour, no. So what's causing all the weight then? Junk, mods. Must be ammo. Gotta be. Uh, okay, so we're gonna drop some ammo. This problem. Oh, yeah, we've got 205 mil rounds, we don't need them. 
There's a way lot of difference though. Oh, two missiles, that'll do it all the time. Yeah. Fusion core still at the loads and loads. We have to swap guns soon. Not for that one. But that goes through quite quickly. So nine fusion cores. They're quite heavy, but we could afford to drop two of those. Right. Okay, so we are yeah, over encumbered now, so we're going to go and do a fast travel to um, wherever it is. Ooh, what's this one? Super Mutants. Yeah, we go for it. And I'll get my slug buster out. It's alright, it's not a euphemism. It's a gun. It's a good gun, but it runs out of um, it really runs out quickly of um, condition. It runs out of condition. Yeah, what I mean. Um, dropping the conversation, but uh, at the moment I'm concentrating on this, I can't do both at once. That's a, that's a improvement, and this is really plasma cart to do this to replace what we've got already.
What do you do that for? What an idiot. All this in a legendary there. Eh? That's what he's got. You keep dreaming that the legendary enemies are going to be carrying that magic gun. Oh, bald cider. I'm going to take it anyway. I'll get rid of it later. Which means the next. <clears throat> what am I doing? Which means the next stop is going to be a train station. I'll get all excited, I do. Yeah. 
three veggie trees. Oh, what the hell. I think need to go to a, a railway station anyway. Nearly that. 36 seconds to go. Kind of, um, yes, very. How much more stuff have I got here? All right, get it. Ooh, thirty-five strip as well. Right. So next step of the way is to find um, the nearest railway station. I'm going to go over here. No. No foundation. I'm not going to see more foundation. Foundation's probably much better. Can't pass travel. So I'm going to go to the west. Okay. Right. Right, just to get me um, carry way back, even though I'm well over in cover as it is. Look at all that stuff I've got. I should get plenty of script for that. That is amazing. All for doing one event. Of course, the railway's over the side of rocks. Look at that, there's loads of rocks. Mutated party pack, that's a lot of fun. Mm, yeah, I know there's a lot of stuff in there anyway. Yeah, which is the British way out of here? So there might be a little way up through here. Well, wasn't that fun? Very noisy, but fun. It's not much to ask, is it? Well, we let them have a jump because we've got loads of junk to keep all of the stuff that we normally have, so uh, that'll be okay. I very often drop my junk, you know. And that isn't a euphemism either. Don't talk to me about life. Oh, it's Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, that was Marvin the Paranoid Android. Life, don't talk to me about life. Where is this road? Oh, it's just west somewhere. Oh, we're going to Foundation, aren't we? That's right. I was ruminating the other day on the fact that it's um, it's kind of sad that I've done a lot of these missions. Come on, what's going on? I can't seem to do anything with this game today. I'm just dropping everything all over the floor. Uh, right. See where we can respawn, um, and let's respawn in actual foundation. So we'll go there. 
Well, perhaps I'm just having one of those days today. This foundation. Now there's several things we can do with it actually, I haven't done quite recently in foundation. One of which obviously is, um, seems to be very jerky this game this morning, I don't know what's going on with it. Yeah, several things we can do that I haven't done recently. Now, Foundation is a home of settlers, um, and we were there are a couple of things we were, we're going to do. Let's just go over there and see if we can find the workbenches first of all. because we're going to fast travel to a railway station to get rid of all the, um, the stuff that we would have to swap for script. <laughs> Underground HQ. Absolutely. Yeah, like they're going to. Uh, like they're going to advertise it. <laughs> I'm really trying to understand what it is about this game. Um, the, it's such a different game. Uh, let's talk to Payback because we haven't spoken to him since we betrayed them. What can I do for you? Uh, Not personally, but I've spoken with Gloria about what I've done. And from what I've heard, you've got a lot of gut people showing up around here. Let's just say it's a good thing you went dealing with me directly. As a whole, I just say, I've heard rumors about. You know, the history of this is we were planning on doing a raid on Port 79. There's supposed to be loads of gold the in there before they started introducing the gold standard. Um, and we chose to go with the raiders instead of these guys, despite doing all the preparation. Right, I've had enough talking to you. What I'm trying to do is there's a gold machine here. There is a gold machine here, and you can swap for various. Hmm. So I keep going off on a tangent, don't I? Uh, right. Finding automated return. Oh, that's Appalachia. Right. Where's the gold terminal in this thing? When I'm under encumbered, I'm going to fast travel another way, actually. Because I'm carrying a lot of weapons at the moment. Actually, one thing we could do, I, I, I keep forgetting I've got these things, but in my. Um, hey, you've got the gold. I knew you could. I've got scrap kits.
That doesn't help me at all. No, still over encumbered. Yeah, I know why, because I've got a lot of stuff in. Um, got a lot of legendaries on me. Until we get rid of those, I'm definitely going to be over encumbered. So, what I think I'll do is still try and go for. Hey, thanks for helping me out, Patrick. I thought the page about this plague of yours made sure he takes this inoculation seriously. The chemistry workbench is right. I'm not going to do a few bits here to allow me. No, not really. Okay. Nope, not up there either. So. If you're looking to trade, check out Sam. Those Mothman cultists looking to trade. I need to know where I want to go here. All I wanted to do is do the gold machine, but I don't even know where it is. I'm getting sick of Tatum. I know they're eating the girl. Yeah, me too. time in this game getting rid of excess weight if you'll pardon the expression this is where fallout will first comes in you can buy fallout first by paying a certain amount every month and that gives you unlimited stash space and you can set your stash up anywhere on on map but it does mean that you're really paying to win and i don't like that in any game Gold, yeah. <laughs> like some gold. And a cannonball. What are those little cannonballs for? Oh, what are you doing today, Phil? I don't know what is wrong with me today. I can only apologise. I must have. Well, I can't. I can't really imagine what's wrong. Um, and we're back up to four hundred and four, five mil rounds again. That's probably another reason why we're over encumbered. That new Coca-Cola inoculation of yours was a pretty smart concoction. Mm. I never would have thought to use that old manufacturing plant. Until we're in a scenario where we can use that stash, I think I'm going to have to... Um, I know we dropped some stuff in there, but... Um, I think I'm going to have to get out of here. Building this place up is hard work. So, it's. I've just done that one. Um, come on, I'll have to get out the normal way. It seems we've got to find Paige's office again. Uh, cool. Here it is. I think I've found a way out somewhere. So, we're still going to have to find a train station because we're carrying a lot of legendary weapons. And the legendary weapons are what is weighing us down. Oh, some lovely music. So, oh, there's the gold machine. Look, there it is. I knew it would be here somewhere. Um, now it's our weapons bench here. Of course, the weapons bench is the one I'll need, and that's the one that isn't going to be there. Uh, right. Scrapping. Don't really need scrapping. I don't think. I can make ammo. Civilization is being rebuilt. Not four and a half ammo though. Oh god, what's going on here? The one thing I need to make, I can't. Right. Right. 
swap these for that. We can do four hundred. Three hundred, so it's ten. So I can do another ten. This goal you can swap for plans, which I will probably do in another another video. Okay, go and see Sonny. See if he's got anything we can actually do with that. Sonny. He's got style that I can You know what I mean? Sure, silly stuff. Get rid of these. The only way to do it, really, is by getting to a railway station or thing. Which nearest one of is yeah. directly? Oh, there's a marker in place already for it. Look. Oh. Jump over here. Over here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what the hell? We'll do it anyway. And then we'll go after this other thing. Uh, I'm heading up for a couple of hours now. I don't know how long I'll be on today, so I'm sort of a little bit stressed out here at the moment. Yeah, that's what I want. Yeah, I was, um, what was I saying earlier on, I completely forgot again, which I tend to do a lot recently, is that um, I don't know what it is about this game. Um, when I'm playing um, Elder Scrolls Online, there's a lot of opportunity for humour. Yet, in this game, um, the humour doesn't seem to be inherent to the game. There are certain opportunities for innuendo. But... Um, There's not the same humour in it as there is in a game like Elder Scrolls Online. Mm -hmm. Right, so we're still going to the station. I'm going to get rid of this script if it kills me. Yeah, it's, it's a bit dark. Yeah, that's where it, that's where you're coming from. I think your life is very grand. You're a nice cup of coffee. I'll be treating myself to a cup of coffee after this. I drink my coffee black, literally black, and very sweet. And I should because I've already got too much weight. Station somewhere. But uh, I can feel a cup of coffee coming on when I finish here today. Yeah, um, so, uh, yeah, 
Uh, the pit boy is, is something which yeah, pit boy or going to the pool level, but um, yeah, I don't know. Um, I suppose the subject matter is all, it's a lot of violence in this. Now, violence in um, Elder Scrolls Online is totally different to this. You're playing with a sword, you're hitting somebody that's obviously an alien character. In this game, you're actually using guns. There's a lot of blood spurt, there's a lot of uh, stuff which could be considered to be um, depressing. I suppose that's why with this game I tend to play um, a couple of hours and that's it. Whereas in um, Elder Scrolls Online most of the time I'm on for three hours. Two and a half to three hours. Uh, right, I'm going to some guns. Buster, that's okay, that's still fine. And the Gauss mini gun is still fine. So the guns are okay, it's just I haven't got ammo for them. Um, so what we want to do is find the, the um, legendary exchange machine and do some script. Plus, of course, I don't know how much scrap I've got left, but it's, it's very little, I would imagine. Uh, right, here we go. Uh, black powder pistol. If you black powder pistol, 270 damage, but it takes forever to reload. So I don't think that's my cup of tea. Uh, assassin short hunting rifle, gun gun rifle. Broad side out is cannonball. You'll be forever juggling your weight there. Cannonballs are really heavy, so we get rid of that. Definitely don't use that. Junkish fire act is a melee weapon, don't use melee weapon. Third right leg armor. This is where all the weight was, you can see that can't you? Full side of this cannonball again. Handy buzz blades, more melee. And Double shooter. Multi stagger. Yeah, the stuff you get from these events is great, but you need to be a certain build to take advantage of them. Um, for instance, melee, obviously. Uh, do I need that or not? No, I don't think so. Got that on other weapons anyway, so I don't know. Right, I am going to ask you to bear with me for a second. I'm not going just yet, but I do want to go and um, tend to some needs, shall we say, and uh, I'll be back in a second. again sorry about that um, the one thing I did notice um, is that uh, I look out the window and it is distinctly uh, less weather wise Chris one thanks for the follow Sorry about this. Um, I'm going to put it on intermission a sec. I've got to check something out. One of the
okay, sorry about that. Um, I had a, a strange call come off my phone that I had to deal with. It uh, basically looks like it might be a scam, though, so I shall uh, worry about that later on. Um, it's one of those things saying, oh, we're expected to do everything and ring us on a certain number, etc., etc. Um, so, yeah. Always worries me slightly when I get calls like that. Anyway, yeah, uh, hey, Grizz Run, thanks for the follow, that's much appreciated. And uh, hope you're enjoying the content. If you do enjoy the content, as always, please uh, follow. And if you're watching this on YouTube, because I, I always send my um, videos over to YouTube after I've done them here, um, leave a like and follow. That does help the channel, and I would like to grow this channel. Not having much luck, but it's gradually getting there. So, uh, yeah, if you could do that, I'd appreciate it. And always, of course, you can do the notifications so that I can know when I'm online. Right, uh, so next one is to find this failure that we were doing, uh, which is in data. And And that is nowhere apparently. <laughs> yeah, I, I always um, thanks for the uh, the chat there, Chris. Yeah, it's much appreciated you joining me and watching this. It's also one of my favourite games. Um, senior in my senses in my sixties. I'm not sure how old you are, but I feel like seventies always have done. Um, so welcome in and hope you enjoy it. Now we're doing some dailies at the moment, um, and one of those is find a research terminal. Do I have to? Oh, no, didn't want that one. That's not the one I'm looking for. Yeah, interesting point. You stream at all? Oh, one tick. Grace, I was shy. The, the problem is, um, I think, with, with streaming, um, when you first go on, you, you think the world's looking at you. I mean, now, I was explaining this to Sykes yesterday. Um, Sykes not whatever. I don't, I'm, not, I'm never sure how to pronounce your name. Sykes not well. But um, I was, as I was explaining yesterday, I um, tend to think now that I'm playing the games and I'm talking to myself. Um, it, it's not as if I've got a mega audience anyway. But at the moment, I just treat it as if I'm playing. Like I'm talking to myself. Uh, whilst I'm playing games and the, the ironic part of that is that when I, do, when I do play games on my own which I do sometimes um, when I'm not online I still talk to myself <laughs> so once you get into that habit you might as well just say that um, you're talking to yourself and it's nothing it's worth giving it a go if you've got a camera Right, so we're going in to find the automated research term. It's not the one I wanted to do, but I'm going to do it anyway. Uh, I'm trying to work out what it is I'm trying to do here. Uh, one of those brain freeze moments. Oh, I know. I didn't do that. <laughs> That's what comes to trying to talk sometimes. Um, you tend to forget what it is you're doing. Um, I go very quiet as well when I'm doing an event or uh, when I'm involved in a big intense mission simply because you need to concentrate. Excuse me. Now, yeah, I'm actually in there. I'll just through this door up here. Yeah. That's pretty peculiar. I've got rad worms. How lucky am I? I've got a disease cure. Um, possibly. 
if you want to do that. Uh, maybe if you're up out, I haven't done a drink. Never mind. Never mind. I don't care. I want rat hands or whatever it is I've got. Take so long. Rad cooties. What the hell's rad cooties with her? <laughs> Welcome in, Capron. How you doing, mate? Rad cooties. I'd like to try that and see what that is. So, I, I'm playing this on. Um, female rad girl. <laughs> I'm playing this on um, obviously on PC and um, also using OBS Streamlabs OBS and Streamlabs OBS quite happily tells me I've only got one viewer well I've clearly got um, as far as I can tell three people involved at the moment so uh, yeah I don't know what's going on there. Really? Really? <laughs> Are you kidding? Right. I'm going to look at this turn if it kills me. It probably will. Now shoot at me. Uh, so, where do I want to go? It's in that room, isn't it? I'm going to have a look at this terminal at last. Yeah, um, I understand where you're coming from there, mate. Um, apparently. Right, sorry, Evac, welcome in. Thanks for the first time chat. How are you doing? Good to see so many people watching. Evac, you're wasting your time. I don't buy anything from um, from people who come into my stream. Sorry and all that, but that's the way it is. people have got um, the need to uh, sell stuff but uh, I don't get involved with that sort of thing this is just a hobby to me it's not a profession so oh, I don't think it's in the toilet am I? I don't know what it is about people, they just, they've got, 
their grift and they need to do it, but uh, it's just annoying. They come into my stream first time I'm sure. Oh, we have to. Is that one that there? Yeah, we do. Completely lost concentration now, what I was doing. Um, yeah, they come into the stream and they try and sell me things I say no, and if they don't want to pull me, that's up to them. But uh, I'd hope, you know, I, I actually felt quite good today that I was getting a few people following. But, um, that I was finally getting somewhere with the followers, and then they try and sell me stuff. So I don't want followers like that anyway, really. Things. One, two. That could be nice. problem mm. oh, damn it. I think a lot of the problem in um, streaming is that people tend to think you're one of these young streamers uh, yeah it's, it's not nice um, I think that a lot of trouble is they, they think we're all young streamers we're doing this professionally and we're all sort of, you know we've got our own IT departments and all that sort of thing with me that just isn't the case, this is a hobby, it always will be until I can afford to buy any decent equipment and that is going to be a long, long time. So uh, yeah, um, maybe they see a chance to sell stuff for people, jump in and jump out again, but uh, I'm not going to let it get, down, get me down anyway. Right, I'm, I'm, I'm doing this but I'm not, I haven't got a clue what I'm doing here, so just bear with me, just use the terminal. I've got to retrieve Scorchby's DNA. I don't think I'll be doing this one somewhere. Um, yeah, most of the streamers I came across when I first started this game uh, were... Um, were of sort of teenagers to mid-twenties and a lot of them still are. If you look on Twitch, you'll see a lot of them are. Uh, I think there are older ones, but um, what I'm getting at in that sense is that people think that you're a big organisation, that you've got uh, you've got mods working on your behalf, that you've got IT people working on your behalf, that you've got loads of money to throw out the channel. Me, I just do this as a hobby. It's as simple as that. 
So if I think you're going to get any money out of me, I've got another thing coming. I just haven't got that amount of money for a start, and I've got other things that I need to do with it apart from um, apart from spending it on the string. I've got a PC, I've got a camera, I've got um, the stuff that I need to go. Um, was it uh, Calcom? When you were saying earlier on about boom. Is that when I'm shooting with the gun? Is it, is it too loud? I can always turn it down. Fish is right, and we're going to die lots and lots and lots and lots. I know the Slugbuster makes a lot more noise than the Fixer does. I tend not to watch my um, my own video, to be honest. Um, it's kind of embarrassing hearing your voice, sort of thing. opportunity to get some ultra sight. Yeah, um, I've only really gathered, Calcron, that I actually um, do this in, in a bedroom. Of the house, um, it's, it's quite empty apart from that. I mean, there's a lot of noise and echoing going on, so I understand where you're coming from. Yeah. Some ultra sight, I'll be needing that eventually because I'm going to have to repair my power armor. It does say here we need scorch beast DNA, but I'm not, really, I'm not sure where I'm going to find that from. I don't know whether I'll be able to do this today. Cheaply, I mean, I'm, I'm looking eventually to buy in a separate camera and microphone because um, the mic and camera built in sort of thing. Sorry, the camera with a microphone built in is not an ideal arrangement. But there's no school speech here, so I don't know if I'm going to do this one or not. Um, I think we might forget that. And said that I can come and get some uh, ultra sight, which is good news. Running out of ultra sight. But that's a yell boy. Yep. Two yell boys. More ultra sight, so we'll have some of that. Yeah, um, uh, I also tried recently, yesterday actually, to um, to do a virtual green screen because the background is not exactly as I want it to be. Uh, so I tried to do a virtual green screen, and basically the um, the software involved really didn't do my camera any good in fact it completely stopped the signal coming through from the uh, from the camera basically it didn't work and uh, after about an hour or two trying to get it sorted i just couldn't be bothered anymore so 
so the result is what you see in front of me here. Right, I'm going to leave this place because I'm, I've been using all my uh, rad oil up, and to be honest, this is uh, this, this going nowhere this day. Um, what I am going to do before I disappear is um, I'll travel out of here for a start and go to camp. Do two caps and break the bank. Oh, of course, I can't fast travel. That would be too easy, wouldn't it? Uh, the railway station is with Hoger over there. We could go that way. Oh, there's a camp before then. I haven't run out of um, uh, railway for ages. Oh, that's interesting. Power on, I think. <laughs> it really isn't my day today, is it? Oh, dear me. What are you doing, Phil? Right, we're going to go to Watoga. What the hell? I'll probably be stopping within about sort of half an hour, mate. Um, but you're welcome to come back, obviously. Um, but uh, things are getting a bit. <laughs> Yeah, it's bad when you get your nose hair starts tickling. <laughs> Why am I so slow? Look at that, your AP. Can't be that over encumbered. Oh, perhaps could have had nothing to eat. Let's try anything. Uh, food and drink. script like that. See if we can get rid of any ammo. Mm. Maybe we don't need 4,000 of those, so if we take that down to a thousand, it should be no, 1,500. that's close enough. There you go, there's where all the weight with that. Plasma um, cartridge. Thousand of those as well. Loads. I didn't realize how much stuff we were carrying. <laughs> I 
200 no yeah, yeah, there you go okay that's that that's how that sorts that problem out way under incumbent now um i don't know what to do for the last half hour or so um i don't really want to do that mission because it need it requires a scorch beast and to be honest i don't know when we're going to see one so we're going to go to um Later, if this is another daily we can pick up on. Confused now. It says follow the overseer's journey. Let's select that and see what we got. Oh dear. I'm really not, not having a good day of it today. Um, mine. No, that's not mine. Follow the overseer's journey. Saying Port Defiance is there, just follow the overseer's journey in Port Defiance. Let's see where it takes us in there. Yes, very strange. Now, I thought I had the one I wanted from here, but apparently not. So let's go down and find out. go and repair the uh, thing why not this is from experience journey but I don't see why I'm sure I've been here before and done that bit but there you go it says to do it so I'm going to go and do it
go up to the next floor. It's nice to have a shave. I um, I say I don't work on Tuesdays, Wednesdays or Thursdays and it's basically a case of I don't shave on those days. Um, give you a nice string because um, you can't wear a little bit of facial hair then. I don't know. But um, then I have a shave on the, on the um, Thursday or Friday. And that's because I'm going back to work on the Friday, basically. Let's try to move the way up there from down here. Ah, there it is. I knew there was a way up. Right, I've got lots of critters around here. Attack, it was right in front of me. Right, so where are we going? Um, Trimmers never seem to work that well for me. I do shave my own hair though. You may have, seen, may have noticed that. Also turn the TV down. I, I use a 48, uh, 4K TV as a, as a monitor, believe it or not. Um, I'll turn that down just in case it's that that's causing noise. Right, up and up and up. I do like that explosive effect, but it's even better when you're using um, Pixar. I thought I had this sound um, more or less, because I do watch the video sort of to see how, um, how they're doing. I thought I had the sound a bit, a bit salty, but obviously it's not as good as I thought it would be. And up we go. Yep. a long way away.
Afterwards, the last one. Apparently not. Okay, let's see if we can go where else we've got to go for this then. Don't show us anywhere. Okay, we're going to look at the map again. So it should show, I've still got the. Um, Still got it active, but it should show where the next bit is. And perhaps the next bit is what I thought it would be, which is to go somewhere where there's a nuke being dropped in there. Look again. Think, thinking about going to um, see um, going to the Rusty Pick and doing some modelling on I've got a lot of script but um, random rolling never seems to produce anything worthwhile for me I usually end up with if it's a gun it's, it's a really crap gun <laughs> See if we can do this one for a moment. And that's probably going to be about it after this. I'm going to do this mission and then see how we go from there. Right, we've got a lot 
more for them. To get a lot of ammo back, I must say. And there's another one. <laughs> now, I'll try and get to. Where are we? Oh, your train yard, it's a good place for acid, very much so. Uh, I'll try and walk across to Watoga. Uh, or alternatively, The less life I've got, or the more I know what I'm talking about, um, the more I can carry. Camp is a good little one, but I don't think I'll be doing that today. I'm going to go to the camp, do some bits and pieces there, and then I think I'm going to call it quits for today. And there she is, home from home. No, she's my scary clown. Oh, not this guy again. He turns off every time I do, and the guns fire at him. So I spend half the time in my camp listening to gunfire. Doesn't shoot me though. Right now. Check on the condition of the armor, which is one of the reasons I came here. Right, as I was saying, check on the condition of the armor. Uh, get rid of all these first of all. Yeah. 
then check on the condition of the armor. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Everything seems okay. I thought this would be worse than that. Thousand two millimeter electronic. Don't know what that's doing in there. Can't close the cartridge. No, 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 no. Okay. Um, right. So next thing. Excavator armor, which gives you the extra carry weight, and also, of course, the uh, the other power armor, the ultra height armor. And the reason I've come down here is because I've got a bobble head, which I'm going to put in there. Start the collection back together again now. Oh, 
Right, um, well, I'm going to leave it at that for now. Um, it's been a fairly strange stream. I've gone from being absolutely useless to having a few notable successes. Again, I mainly ended up uh, putting most of my uh, stuff in storages and trying to get rid of stuff I don't want and trying to keep my weight down, which is about part of the course. I must learn not to pick up everything that I see. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a bad habit of mine. I pick up everything and then I'm overweight and then I have to go and sort it out. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. As always, if you enjoyed this, um, drop a follow. And if you're watching on YouTube, then uh, give us a like or a follow. Or both. <laughs> a follow, a like or subscribe or both. And um, hopefully I'll see you next time. Uh, I'm not sure whether I'll be doing the stream tomorrow or not. I'll see how it goes. Um, Saturday I'll be out. Next Tuesday I probably won't because my neighbours having some work done. So that won't be worth watching. Uh, so it may be a while so I'll see you again I might do one tomorrow, I'll see how it goes anyway see how I feel so thanks for watching and uh, hopefully I'll catch you again fairly soon look after yourselves, have a great afternoon bye for now